decided to come out and walk to the store, and it's just as soon as I step out the door, the rain, first the plane fall, it flies over, and then the raindrops start falling. And this is what it did. Every time I tried to take a walk last spring, as soon as I stepped out the door, the raindrops would start falling. It wouldn't be raining, I'd step outside, and it would be raining. And then it got more and more um, dramatic to where there would be these giant cloud bursts that happened a couple times. It's starting to get more dramatic right now. They can turn it on like within seconds. It's like the rain machine. Here it comes. At last spring, I was smart about it. I would always walk out with an umbrella no matter what. And I didn't do that today. Not a drop. There was not a drop. The ground was dry when I walked out the door. And normally I wouldn't think anything of it except for the coincidence of it happening so often when I decide to take a walk outside. Within minutes, this is what happens. Sometimes it's just a few drops, but other times it's like this. So remember the dark side of the moon and the lines when the cloud bursts thunder in your ear, you shout and no one seems to hear. And when the banyard in starts playing different tunes, I'll see you on the dark side of the moon. So, this that song was from the 70s. Did they have this technology in the 70s? I think they might have. I was just telling Chris today that probably around 1976 I believed that I could make the wind blow with my mind and these little marbles that someone had given us that were basically mind control devices they were just small little pieces of glass with cracks in them and somehow we were given the idea that we could tell, tell the future or control the future with these <laughs> small pieces of glass and it appeared to work in my case I could either predict the future and I could command the wind to blow why did I get it in my head to command the wind to blow I don't know but I can tell from that and many other and several other at least things that I can remember make me think that ideas are being put into my head from remote sources through frequencies and I believe it's the same basic frequencies that can be used to create weather to literally create weather like I said, it was, I've been out here, I'll, I'll put timestamps on this video, let's upload this video, I'll put timestamps on it. You can see how fast it got this wet. It's probably been 15 minutes maybe since I walked out onto dry concrete. In fact, if you think about that song, Dark Side of the Moon, you can tell it's a song about mind control. Because it's about the lunatic, you know, the lunatic is in the grass, the lunatic is in my head. You something, something, you, re you rearrange me till I'm sane is one of the, it's about playing with someone's mind.
And in fact, the last lines of that song is, the sun is eclipsed by the moon. By which I think he meant the moon being the dark, you know, the dark side or the darkness or what representing the darkness or representing the occult has um, taken over the sun with mind control. And I think that um, that's a lot of what that album was about. And maybe even what a lot of Pink Floyd was about. Especially later. Here it comes again. Ah! I almost just walked out of the dry spot. No, here it comes. They're going to turn it up again. Okay, come on. This is not, this should make people a believer. This is not a natural rainstorm. Here's a bunch of grapes just randomly on the ground. And here comes the rain again. Coming through my head like a memory. Ah, uh, look, here's where the grapes came from. A box that says Spectrum. And these are homegrown grapes. I can tell. Let's make a boat. <laughs> 